social media gameplay moribund murdoch feed diy tool that lets high schoolers practice gene editing very cool scholasms pedantic slash academic expressions i am an intellectual i know these words these fancy joggings this ergot or scorner a derogatory term for a person constantly mooching from others sir i want some more please give me some more of the goodness of the soups i beg you grandfather please lend me some more money along with the next missive you sent me marijuana may not lower your iq rigorous new studies should be able to settle the matter diverticular disease look it up it's a good by the gastrointestinal society ephemera things that exist or are used or enjoyed for a short time ephemera things that exist or are used or enjoyed only for a short time jigum jigum now jigum see jigum now right now no the war on drugs otos frustraneous stupid oh no david bowie was arrested prohibitionists are dasties tis self-evident prohibitionists hashtag bowie arrested hashtag bowie forever bowie david bowie's mugshot from 1976 bowie was arrested for marijuana possession which resulted in possibly the most photogenic mugshot ever taken babelicious Ooh. david bowie moon age daydream wonderful track of music beautiful melodious telephony shy shy shillist socialist a person who pretends to be a scholar an intellectual fakey battle of the austrians krugman sky mackie ski mackie ski a mackie a fight with a shadow a mock or futile combat <laughs> oh mm. uh, fagus <laughs> fagus feeding on the dead or decaying animal matter the vulture is a good image for that saltation a dance or the act of dancing see saltation saccade rapid movement of the eyes saccade <laughs> what okay and public sector based mandatory occupational licensing so this is uh progressive bias well actually no it's only like half the progressive movement's bias and much of the libertarian bias is that opinion hippie style free migration i'm a one of those globalist people more people across borders more goods more every money's everything you know i'm open border i'm kind of crazy i guess i'm not really into the whole nation state stuff i'm into all the secession movements i'm into the catalonians hong kong i probably shouldn't say that i'll get banned from going to china i like china honestly uh you know the taiwans that's not really secession that's like uh, never mind i shouldn't say this stuff dangerous you get banned on the internet uh, facebook youtube if you'd have to yatta hurrah yay i made it an interjection expressing approval appreciation or happiness Convini convenience store oh andrew yang versus jeff myron i'm not sure this debate is still on i think liberty con deleted this debate i don't know why it was a good one I'm liking Andrew Yang less and less because of the Joe Biden endorsement and whatnot. I don't know. He's fading in the the sex appeal, they said. I don't know. Maybe I'm totally BSing there. And I'm kind of obsessed with austerity and whatnot. Jeffrey Myron from the Harvard University. I really appreciate the governments that actually save money or have sovereign funds and whatnot and not in massive in debt. Like, I'm cool with the stimulus and whatnot. It's not the end of the world. Like, if it works, it's fine. But I mean, if you're in debt and you're doing it, it's not really good. It's just like somebody taking out way too much credit card debt and leveraging it. And, you know, it's crazy. Jeffrey Myron. Ooh, yes. Interesting dude. Breaking Dawn Vagabond Music. OSD. Yes, I should look into that. Japanese Learning. Learning the Japanese. Te... Teoku. 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 Toku. Toku. Something. Teokeba. Whatever. <laughs> Grand Pyronic. Of relating to or characteristic of a tyro or beginner tyronic see tyronic treen made of wood wooden treen Ooh, that's a nice yeah that's a nice piece of art made of the woods gallop poll a sampling of public opinion on a particular issue that's the gallop guy himself diplomaniacs medical condition involving an uncontrollable craving for alcohol and there is k pooper drinking alcohol likely or water i don't know 
fine shape, good condition, nice slang, fine shape. She's in fine shape for the Myrocong. The fall of something bad happened to someone. Melancholiac, or melancholiacs for the plural. One subject to melancholia. The folks who are subject to melancholia. Guilt complex, an obsession with the idea of having done wrong. And Moribund Institute sounds. Yeah, I'm trying to get into recording sounds. I don't have proper equipment, though. I don't have any sort of proper equipment. Like, you can see this type of recording is a display capture. I zoom in out of desperation. Cute! Wow, she's. I'm very jealous of the face. Wow, and the hair is perfect, too. I'm jealous. Uh, melting me softly. It, the script writing was really weird in this one. I felt bad for the actors. They. I think they did their best. I don't know. It was. It was. You know the. The idea of the story is great, but the whoever wrote the script struggles. They needed to rewrites or something. That should be. It should be rebooted with the same cast because the cast was fantastic in Melting Me Softly. I felt bad. It was really good, but uh, not so good. I don't know how to describe that show. It was weird. Ad Adem. In agreement. At the meeting of the minds. Oh yeah, I should remember to use this. This is cool. All these Latin phrases can be kind of cool, but very snobbish. I know, but they're fun. You know, they're a fun little thing. Should I make the ad adem political party, asking to myself, or the dialectical method political party? So I think the dialectical method political party is sort of like my idea of liberal by definition, open to all the ideas liberal party. A liberal party that's not snobbish to other parties. Because I'm of the more liberal psychographic, and I honestly have trouble talking to conservatives and whatnot. I'm more comfortable with like the progressive side, I guess I'm more left libertarian or whatever that is, but... I don't know, I want to become more open to all the ideas because I realize that I'm sort of an idiot and I probably need help from the group. Because the group, I am i don't know, I'm into that gaffism, particularly when it pertains to a group that like a group usually tends towards the ultimate good over time, albeit they should could make mistakes and repeat. The problem is I'm worried that our lifespans are too short for a gaffism at that time, that like the the public consciousness can forget important lessons pretty quickly. Albeit with the internet, that stuff may fade and we'll learn lessons quicker. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know the future. Uh, okay. I would use... Th if our lifespans were longer, a lot of problems, I think, would go away. Albeit people would be more cautious, I reckon. If, like, uh, the only thing that really killed people instead of old age was accidents and whatnot. People would get overly paranoid and live in VR world and that's it. In a lead bunker. <laughs> Lead, no, probably not lead. What am I talking about? Ugh. <laughs> lead. What I think I'm thinking of radiation. I don't know. What it is. I would use the phrasing the government caused the opioid crisis with its prohibitionist policies, but whatever. I'm too libertarian for the, the general voter base. Let's see what Aunt Yang used. Our government was complicit in the creation of the opioid. That's, that's pretty good. That's good phrasing. So we must do more to help those impacted. Yeah. I would say they caused. Yeah. I'm a bit more harsh, but. He's a politician. Honey fugul. To flatter with sweet talk or to get what you want. Yeah, Andrew Yang was honey fuguling the political folk with his words, Wallace appealing to the normal folk. He was doing the honey fugul very good. Andrew Yang is a, a very interesting politician, very cool. More interesting than most people out these days. Nebula. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's an educational platform. I like it very much. The film, The Forest of Love, is a lysophobia. Lysophobia catalyst. What, the fear of going insane? What is this? Lysophobia. Oh yeah, lysophobia. The intense terror of becoming mad, insane, or having a nervous breakdown, slash having the fear of rabies. Oh, that's kind of interesting how those are connected. And fear of catching rabies. Okay. Uh, Anugulman. Anugulman. Frantic, zealot. One, expressing him or himself with great energy, excitement, or vehemence. I need to learn the French stuff. I like the French TV, albeit a lot of people don't like it. I love French TV. And Korean TV I love a lot, too. And uh, everyone loves Japanese TV because of animes, obviously. But French I really want to get into. It's easier, I think, to get into for my situation. I think all teachers should assign homework for a topic is reviewed after the topic has been reviewed so that the teacher can see if there is an improvement of understanding in the topic after the lecture. Maybe weigh the grade so that the assignment before the lecture is weighed around 42%. Why that arbitrary number? Okay. Of the grade. Wallace, the assignment after the lecture is weighted around 58% of the grade. Eh. All right. Yeah, well, I mean, it sounds actually not a bad idea. It's arbitrary, but I, yeah. 
it's coming from me. That's probably why I like the idea. <laughs> I'm having this thought because I read this dude who was given more, <laughs> even more roundabout and stupid than I when it comes to writing, and I was supposed to be able to distill an argument in a night. I ended up getting an 81, making my grades for the class an 85, 100, and an 81, making my average an 88.67. Yeah. Mm. Lipophobia, a fear of dietary fat. Yeah, what helps though with the college grades, I reckon, is you gotta definitely read ahead, read ahead, be prepared with the material for class. I think that's common sense, really. And double the class time for study. Yada yada yada. College basics. <laughs> One college 101. I pray you be, you know, because they're not gonna adapt to what you want. You know, they're not. Uh, they're not gonna review chapter one and you know, well, it's the, towards the end of the class. Yada yada. They don't do stuff like that. Like normal people do when they learn stuff by on their own. I pray you be seated and sup how you f please. <laughs> I, play, I pray you be seated and sup how you please. Great, Dracula. I read Dracula in Japan. I should have posted this in 2017. Maybe I had a note that I held on up until 2019. Yeah, Dracula was way too confusing for me to read. I'm not good with the whole out of chronological order when I'm reading. I get so confused and almost frustrated. Sound in the Fury was annoying too, because like, ooh, this is happening then, and this, and that, and all. What, what, what's, what's the chronological? Just do it in order! God damn it! Dracula was like that. It was crazy. Oh, cool names. Dean, Jordy, Jet, Miles, Rock, Mal, Mal. Mm. <laughs> so making a hasty toilet, I went into the restroom. So making a hasty toilet, I went into the restroom. So making a hasty toilet, I went into the restroom. Somehow his words and his look did not seem to accord, or else it was that his cast of face made his smile look malignant and saturnine. Transvaluation, this is what, they just spoke to Thora, and God is dead, this is Nietzsche shite. Cool, I think. <laughs> Transvaluation would mean the exaltation of life rather than the exaltation of suffering and an acceptance of every instinct or lust as organic and therefore valid citation needed. And so behind the scope of moral condemnation, what one desires would be merely what one des desires rather than... <laughs> what? This doesn't sound like the... Um, Attack on the Shell. Mm, renegade Angel Xavier. <laughs> one desires in the end. Rather than either sinful or pious, what one desires would be the product of stimuli rather than the product of will. What am I on about? I wasn't paying attention. I really should have paid attention while reading it. Louch of questionable taste or morality. Decadent. Oh, that movie made me so uncomfortable. Why did I even talk about this movie? That guy reminds me of somebody. I can't remember right now. It's really not good. Murdoch Maxwell is often described as pleonasmic. Play pleonasmic. It's not really intuitive how to pronounce this. Of a person given to, you know, roundabout way, using way too many words in speech or writing, trying to compensate for his lack of I natural IQ using silly vocabulary words. Well, no. Vocabulary words gives you more things to associate with and helps you more brainstorm an idea for it, so it's really useful. It kind of it does artificially give you more things to think about, which probably does help with IQ. Peggy Lee, Manana, it is soon enough for me. Dogen, Japanese bank. Yeah, Dogen's a great channel. He's very good at stuff. He's good at the lice and stress with the angry young. James Litchell, re-regalizing, legalizing drugs. Yeah. Legalizing drugs with Jeffrey Myron. I like that. I want drugs to be legalized. I'm one of those people. Power of incentives. I'm one of those people. Public choice theory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. How much of our lives is determined for us because we give in to simplicity following the system as they're libertarian? This guy is very scammy, but I, I don't know why I like him anyways. It's weird. It's probably he just appeals to my psychographic too much. When the manager earnestly advised a libertarian raconteur not miss the final shuttle, the man looked up from what must have been, conservatively, his sixth or seventh rum and coke, and remarked, quite matter-of-factly, shuttles are for slaves, is his declaration took a while to sink in. Shuttles are for slaves? What exactly did he mean? <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, he could have... It was, I like, uh, yeah, I, I relate to the... Anti-authoritarian stuff way too much. That's why I'm I understand a lot of the progressive stuff and the libertarian stuff a lot. Albeit I'm I'm not you know fully educated yet, so I can't really make up my mind. But I like both those a lot. I'm kind of 
very uneducated with the conservative stuff. I really don't understand that yet. I'm also a religious, so I, the conservative stuff often is kind of uh, the word. It uh, puts me off, I guess. Or I guess I'm agnostic. I'm not really a religious. I can't prove. I'm not gonna have the faith that there is no God. I'd be like, it's possible to prove it, but I don't know how we would possibly prove it. But yeah, agnostic is the right term, I guess. Or weak agnostic, if I'm getting semantical. <laughs> Moment of 18. Did I even watch this? I probably dabbled in it. This was really good. I should have finished it. Uh, he's fantastic. It makes me wish I was an actor. That guy, he's like really good. Sometimes like you're really impressed with how somebody acts. Like, damn it, I should be an actor person. <laughs> You knew. Oh, did I? I gotta add this to my Spotify. Oh, yeah, my Pokemon Dream Team. Let's see what it is. Mega Charizard Y. Aloha Nine Tails. Is that the, the new one? Golurk. Aerodactyl. Wash Rotom. Infernape slash Blaziken. Same Pokemon, pretty much. <laughs> Lol. Actually, I think Infernape's better. Dilator. <gasps> Ooh, that may be, uh, may be controversial. Dilator. Tending or intended to cause delay characterized by procast procrastination purgy mm, i have to beg my college to let me read stuff blood money bayer's inventory of hiv contaminated blood products and the third world homophiliacs i mean i think the abstract is what made this interesting i have to read the abstract i think i really did want to read this so i so you have to pay for all these research things it's such a pain in the ass somebody should make it open source or some shite Oh, you have to pay $54 a month to use a research paper. I want to be educated. I'm an idiot. Let me read shite, sir. Newspapers, too, could be a pain in the ass. Have this, I want to read all these sorts of newspapers so I can have a better worldview instead of just reading one newspaper. I want to read, like, 18 different viewpoints. And then you have to pay for every one, pretty much. $8 a month. $8 a month. I can't afford this, man. I want to be knowledgeable. Okay, when a movie theater hangs up after a robot telling you to go to a website, and when your local movie theater lets you go through heaps of menus and punch into zip codes only to be greeted by a high-pitched ringing noise and to be hung up on, Murdoch Maxwell attempted to ask about the show times for the 2019 exit Korean disaster comedy movie, Regal Cinema, Regal Cinema, why do people even movie theater, man? Marked up chance to be shot by some loony. Lesson here is to stay indoors and never talk to anyone ever. Yeah, yeah. Robots, man. Don't even have people to talk to. I want to find out where an exit is, and I'm going to do my best to see that movie, albeit I just saw it online when it came out, and I had to wait. No, because America. Because that's a really good movie, actually. It's a popcorn flick or whatever. Yongi Nail. Okay, now I'm actually going to look at the Hungo and try to read the Hungo. Young. Yeah, yeah. Young Yi Ne. No, it's like E. It's like N and then E. Then E. It's like U. O. E. U. Young Yi Ne. Yo. Long Yi. Yo. Long Yi. No. 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 Young Yi Ne. Yo. Long Yi. Ne. Yo. I have to like mumble it. That's how. That's how you make it natural. You gotta mumble it together. Young Yi Ne. Yo. Long Yi. Ne. Yo. Long Yi. Ne. Yo. Long Yi. Ne. Yo. I'm, t I'm pronouncing everything. It doesn't sound natural. Yongi neo, no yongi neo, nongi neo, nongi neo, nongi neo. It's like a tongue twister. Courageously, homi homiletic, homi homili homili homiletic. See, normally, after I butcher the pronunciation in making a video, after I watch the video of me butchering the pronunciation, I can pronounce it fine. It's kind of weird. I don't know what that's called, but homili homili. Homilietic, homilietic, of relating to or resembling a homily, of or relating to homilietic. Korean slang, uh, this is like a Modi spell. Marriage Not Dating, that's a great show. Not to me. A romantic comedy about a man who doesn't want to get married and a woman he meets. The inflammation in his sides caused by the micro trauma that was caused by Sakura's punch to the side could not be seen or felt. Oh, yeah, I was trying to make a vocab book. Before, I made a really good start of a vocab book. This is kind of poo-poo. This is what the Linux software. <laughs> Supplies for Pathfinder character, diodomatic, full fat milk, red bell peppers, cocaine. Oh, I'm trying to be uh, David Bowie. Oh, I, this is probably way too long right now. I'm not even, I can't edit more than 20 minutes. Of, oh, shit, yeah, 25 minutes. 